all right guys welcome back to the channel so it's been at least a couple weeks since we've done any sort of field work just because it's been so wet and very cold so it doesn't dry out very well but it's dried out enough so we're gonna hop back into it dad's shredding stalks right now i'm gonna go take over for him so he can go set the disc and then once he sets the disc i'll get disking and we can knock these ridges down and then dad can continue shredding stalks so let's go I'm in the chopper and it's doing what it's supposed to do. I mean, it's not even our chopper since our chopper that we share with someone else, that thing is broke because we're waiting on bearings for that thing. And we can't even get any bearings because apparently they're somewhere else and they can't be shipped. Who knows what's happening today in this day and age. But anyway, we're waiting on bearings. So we're just using someone else's chopper, 15 feet wide. It's an old thing, but it's getting it done. Dad's back in the stock shredder. Well, he just had one more pass here, and now he's cleaning it off, and then he's gonna head over to the Mauer farm and start sh shredding stocks there. Now I'm just disking down these ridges that are from the Buffalo row crop cultivator. We ridge so it covers up around the stock, so that way it covers up any small weeds that come up around the corn, just to keep the weeds down. And then I'm knocking those down because when we take the chisel plow and go sideways or, or diagonally across the field, we don't want to be running over ridges because the tractor would just be bouncing like crazy. You couldn't even, it just break everything. So I got to knock these ridges down and then when I'm done here, I'm going to head over to the Mauer farm and start disking down ridges over there. I'm done at the home farm, got that field all disked up. Now I'm gonna head to the Mauer farm and I'm gonna go start disking over there.
just disking around a wet spot. Don't know if you can see it, but I'm just disking around it because I can't turn out in there. So I'm gonna disk this smooth so I have somewhere to turn because it's rough like this and I'll just get it done now so I have somewhere to turn. My goodness, that's rough. That's it for this small field. I've got that other field to do, but that's too wet to do tonight. Just muddy. So I'm not gonna do that field yet. Probably tomorrow or the next day. Just depends on how much it dries out. But I'll get this folded up. Then I'm gonna unhook the disc and bring the 240 home because dad wants to use the 240 to chisel plow tomorrow. So gotta unhook the disc and then drive this tractor home. hook from the disc and now I'm gonna take the 240 home well guys I was just gonna go start chiseling 
and we were looking over the chisel plow and dad just, well he started chisel plowing and he found, or I found, some a broken bracket back there that holds those harrows. So we're gonna go weld a bracket before I can start chiseling again, or before I start chiseling. All right, I got chisel plowing and it's doing a pretty good job. It's ripping deep enough, still a little bit wet, muddy, but we're getting it done. We got the chisel plow shanks set to where they're running about 15 inches in the ground. So they're going down pretty deep, just breaking up that compacted dirt, compacted soil, whatever you want to call it, mud now. But all that that was compacted through the air, just breaking that up getting it busted loose so over winter it can freeze and that deep hard freeze will help bust it up even more. So just getting our deep tillage done and I'm moving along about seven acres an hour, ninth gear, full throttle and it's still only going about five and a half miles an hour. So it's about all this tractor can handle to pull five shanks 15 inches deep. I'm still going but I'm getting really close to being done yeah I've only got a few acres left just gotta finish up a couple passes here go along this go around all the ends then I'll be done with this field Just finishing up the ends of this field and then I've got or I've got two ends to finish up and then I'll be done with this field and we'll call it a night. <laughs> 